so in this video we're going to create a win checking method in the map to tell us whether or not the game is over because there is a win. So in the map, head over to the map and we're going to just create a method public boolean 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 is there a win. And remember questions need to return something. There is a win. Uh, and we'll just create that boolean here. There is a win. And we'll set it to false initially. And uh, then we need to create an integer to keep track of whether or not there are any other uh, there are any bricks in the map. So int brick bricks remaining. We'll start it at zero. And then we need to loop through the map. The map uh Oh yeah, for int row equals zero, row is less than the map dot length row plus plus for int column equals zero. This loop should go until the value of column is no longer less than the map at row zero dot length call plus plus and if I oh, know and all we need to do is uh, bricks remaining plus equals the map at row column because uh, we, we only care about whether or not bricks remaining stays at zero and then if at the end of both these loops if bricks remaining equals zero equals equals zero there is a win we set that to true and we return the value so now we have a win checking method and now we need to put it to use over in our game panel so update uh, we need to keep track of, I think we're just going to do this for now under the draw method. So we're going to say public, we're going to create another method. Public void draw win. And we're going to pass this method, the graphics tool. Oh no, we don't need to do that. Draw win. And we're going to say g dot set color, color dot red and then g dot draw string winner at I don't know this is just a guess 200 by 200 and we also need to I want to set the font so g dot set font at new font let's just use courier new and font dot bold at um, size I don't know, 50. Uh, okay, so under draw then we need to, I want to draw this on top of everything else, so we say if the map dot is there a win equals true, then we want to say draw win. Uh, I think this should do it, although it may screw up the HUD. So under the HUD, let's set the g.set font new font courier new font dot plain and we'll just do that to like 12 point or 14 point. Um, and then so that uh, you don't have to watch me play an entire game of Brick Breaker, let's set the map to only have uh, two bricks. One row, two columns. Alright, let's see if it does it. <laughs> and, okay, that one went away. Come on, come on. Go get them. Yeah, buddy. Winner. It doesn't stop the game yet, but at least it knows to display that at the right time. 
And that's enough for this video.